Hello and welcome to the streaming Parson Plays Heroes of Might and Magic 2 The Price of Loyalty. And today, we're going to finish off the Southern War map. Yes, I just had to. It's been a while since I've done recording, so I needed to check what I was doing again. That will happen from time to time. Okay, there's a castle over there that we need to go to. So let's uh, go there. So when I ended the last episode, I took over this castle, had Uncle Ivan chill out in it for a bit, because I wanted the full MP to use this bad boy right here. Oh yes, it's been a while since I got to abuse this. And um, yeah, that's, that's exactly what we're going to do. It's been a while, so come on, warp. And I think the castle's over here, right? Yeah. I think there's a castle up there too, but we'll go this way first. Oh, come on. get close enough. That's okay, though. I'm basically at that point where I can't be beaten. The enemy, the enemies would be hard-pressed to be able to catch up to me at this point of the game. Alright, I let this town get abducted. But, uh, I'll quickly fix that. Yikes. I'll be losing some, uh, some trolls, I guess. Ow. Ow. Alright, got him. Okay, so... We're just gonna chill out here for a bit. Several. So first we take out this guy. These guys are no match for me at this point. I mean really, Uncle Ivan is just like, doing work, you know? He's just... How strong is he anyway? He's pretty powerful now. He's level 17. Which is pretty high for any hero to get on a given map. To be fair though, Uncle Ivan does start at level 5 or something like that. With 13 attack, 15 defense, 12 spell power, like this guy is so powerful. Once Uncle Ivan gets a couple more Titans, it's gonna be basically laughable. Oh, you jerk. I should have done that a little better, but it doesn't really matter, so... Take some gold, I guess. Nothing else I can really learn. Whoops. Day is it day five? All right. Oh, he just ran off. He didn't bother to like defend this place. Oh, this is gonna be kind of hairy.
Thanks. Oh. What? I forget, when you're not using Uncle Ivan, everybody see feels so weak. Ow. I don't like this. I really don't like it. I'm in a really bad position. Archer's just getting, like, blasted away there. Ow. There you go. I mean, all my Cavaliers are still intact, so... That's what ultimately matters. Alright. Ooh, we got some decent spells here. Got a couple of trolls, that ain't bad. and all the good stuff. And she's just gonna go collect some materials for the army. Look at all that good luck. Just... Oof. Whoa, he did a lot of damage there. What the heck? Alright, I have no idea what I'm doing with this guy. Whoops. Did not mean to do that. Oh dear. This guy's probably gonna die here. Yeah, she's gonna attack. With this many guys, though, she'll probably beat me. Ow. Come on, you can blind, right? You can blind. Yeah, boa. But I mean, this guy is enough to do, like, so much damage to me, so I don't think it really matters. gonna slowly shoot them down I guess. But I'm also out of MP for blinds. We got one more. That's all we got. Ow. Ow. These guys just blast away my uh, orcs. Oh. Really, game? You gotta do that to me? You gotta do me dirty like that? Well, we just wait for the inevitable... They shoot me down. Oh, dang. That hurt. Oh. Oh. Oh, what? We're gonna take out this guy.
Very nice. Yeah, that's how it feels. Alright, he's coming for me. Kinda don't wanna deal with that. Very nice. Alright. Yeah, that's how it feels. Yeah, you like that, huh? Oh, hello, the holy hammer. The holy hammer gives you plus five attack. It's a very high level artifact. So there's a guy down here. If I give her enough dragons, I think she'll be more than... Uh... get the trolls or do I get the now the three trolls are stronger actually I think Uncle Ivan can make it just checking which door it is Yeah, Dimension Door is silly, right? It's so stupidly powerful. Yeah, yeah, that's nice. Uncle Ivan's got this in the bag, boys. coin and the power ring. And you will take this. Uh, what do I not need? I don't need this. I don't need... Hmm, that might come in handy actually. I don't need this. Uh, I guess I don't need this. Uncle Ivan has expert leadership, so I think he's good. I don't think I have um, enough MP to make it to that area in one turn. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Mr. Piccolo. Six Titans should be able to do the trick. Where'd that other guy come from? Take this town first, rest in this town, and then chase this guy starting the next turn. Let them come. Eleven times gonna take a 51 ogres in one hit. That is a beautiful thing to see. That's just like, oh, that makes me feel good. Okay, 
Yeah, Uncle Ivan needs to chill out here for a bit, actually. I'm like out of mana, so... I doubt there's anyone actually up there. No, it's just Uncle Ivan's gotta chill out here for a bit. Uncle Ivan's just gonna warp over here and, uh. Surprise! I mean, honestly, Dimension Door is so broken. There's a reason why in later installments they nerfed it to the ground. Because for me to just teleport basically anywhere on the map now, as long as I have MP and movement, you can warp. And that's basically unfair for them. Okay, take out the really slow guy so you just get a chance to run away. And then you just let, like, you just caught from castle to castle each turn. And the AI, for some reason, well, I mean, I think there is a re the, I think the, how the AI works is the towers will always hit the highest threat. If, and the, the priority is highest threat range unit, which is the Titan. And so the Titan is really good in this game because the fact that it has 300 hit points and will always draw tower fire makes him a great like damage sponge, right? Because I'm basically never going to lose units as long as the Titan is here to just absorb damage for me. Oh, he never bought these guys. Um, okay. Works for me, I guess. I mean, I'm not one to complain about free stuff, so... Nice. There's no castle up here hidden, is there? Yeah, this guy's kind of whatever. Someone will eventually catch him and he's basically toast. I mean, that guy thinks he's safe, but he's not, because I'm just gonna teleport in the dark. And take him out. This video will be a little bit longer, because I'm just gonna finish this map. But, I mean, with Uncle Ivan having Dimension Door, it should be quite doable. Now, if I recall, there's actually a very powerful warlock town down here. I do need to keep my eyes peeled for. Question is, where the heck is it? Okay, I'm not gonna warp right here. I assume someone's gonna show up from somewhere around this area of the map. Oh, what? Those archers joined him? Yeah, they, I assume there's nothing up here. Okay, what does this town even have? Does it have rangers? It doesn't. I actually just build up this town just because I can. I'm gonna build up this thing here. And then I'm gonna upgrade the archer hut to rangers. I think is a good plan. Seriously, where where is this town? There's probably something over here I missed. One of my other heroes will have to go after it.
Ah, hi there. What, really? All these enemies, all these armies joined his army? That's just like, that's weenie dog. Take okay, fifth. This is gonna take way more damage to kill, so I'll just shoot that first. I think I just played that, unless the AI does something really dumb, yeah, like that. Unfortunately, this guy's not powerful enough that I am gonna lose at least one Titan. not lose a Titan. Nice. Okay, she's actually gonna get into the fight pretty soon too. Oh. Where's that guy coming from? Is he coming from here? Oh. Oh yeah, see I was correct in my assumption there. in here. I'll just walk. Because I gotta rest in this castle anyway, so... Oh. Nice move. But, uh... No dice. Eleven Titans just does so much work in the right hands. What can I say? Uncle Ivan is amazing. I thought those were regular ogres and not ogre lords, but not like that matters. Alright, we're just gonna chill out here for a bit. Okay, I really need her to get this town. Get a whole bunch of units. This'll be easy, I, I got this in the bag. Red has been vanquished. So who's left? We got yellow. Yellow's got like castles down here, I think. And then... Okay, does she have wisdom? No, she's, she has no experience whatsoever. Doesn't matter. Three dragons should do the trick, right? If not, I'll bring some cannon fodder. Oh. Oh. That's really awkward. Yikes. Um. Ugh. I did not prepare this town very well. Yeah, that's, that's not good. Um, I'm gonna get this guy. And hopefully he will do the trick. Oh. He will not do the trick. Ah, I guess I didn't uh, do that part very well. I, I don't think there's a castle up here. There's no way, right? Come 
Come on, I can do it. Oh yeah, there is a castle over here somewhere, so... I'm just gonna send Uncle Ivan this way, though, because my other guys can take care of that. Oh, I know there's another castle somewhere in there. We're on day six? Okay. I'm pretty sure there's nothing in here, but I better check. This town is so gone. you can. So we're gonna spend this time shooting other stuff, like these walls. Only two, come on. He's casting haste on those guys. Oh, come on. Really? Shoot like that. I don't want to hit this guy, because he actually gives him a morale penalty. Ow. seeing a rainbow over 75 orcs, you just know it's one of those, like, you wince because you know of how much it's gonna hurt. Uh, uh. Well, that is unfortunate, though. The best part about Dimension Door is that you can also use it to go like into a pitch black area. Because the game will automatically find like this is a landable area, so you should be fine if you Dimension Door here. Really game? Really? Fine, be that way. Where the heck is Yellow's base? Like, I'm so confused. Okay, Green is just running around. Okay, I need a lot of these guys, though. Because... I lost quite a few uh, archers earlier. What? Only two weeks worth? Felt like she was gone for longer. Uh, where the heck is Yellow's base? He upgraded these guys, which means he uses disruption ray, which means I can just blind, uh... I have enough MP for a blind. Butte. Just 
gonna hang out up here. And then restart the turn, and there you go. Ooh. Okay. Since there's no chance there's a guy over there, so we'll just... Okay, yeah, there is nothing up here. Thanks for wasting my time, game. Where the heck is Yellow's remaining base? He must have something down here, because... I can't seem to find anything. I'm gonna fight this horde of zombie because maybe I can get a uh, level up for. This hero and get Dimension Door if she gets expert wisdom. Thanks. Wisdom. Okay, now I need to just put guys on this area over here and just keep my eyes peeled for the rest of Green's army. I was hoping I'd be done this map already, but oh well. Suppose it can't be helped. The fact that 120 halflings can just take out a bunch of ogres like that just shows you how powerful I've become. I mean, look at Uncle Ivan. Look at these stats. <laughs> it's, it's to the point of absurdity. I mean, I don't even know why I'm bothering with this guy now. I mean, she was technically the starting hero. Thank you. And now we scour this whole eastern seaboard, I guess you could say. of his towns. There's nothing here, nothing here. There might be something down here, but there, there's really nothing else. I've taken over the whole map, haven't I? Mm. Yes, of course. Right, let's warp down here. Warp over here. We can't warp over here, can we? I don't think so. Should I take two warps like this? There you go. Let's pick up a couple of dragons and then... I have no idea what I'm doing with you, but... You can't be all that's left of Green's army. Okay. Uh, 
I would really hate to warp over here and find out that there's nothing here. Alright, we got Dimension Door. The Six Dragon should do the trick. Oof, that ate all her mana, didn't it? Oh. This town, I'm gonna sacrifice it again, but I suppose it can't be helped. Right, this is the la this is Green's last castle, so we should be done with him pretty soon. But you know, can you imagine how long this would have actually taken me if I did not have access to stuff like Dimension Door? I think about that. Ivan's kind of stuck because I'm out of MP with him now. Well, that was dirty. Oh, he's really confident he's just going to take that town. I'm so confused. Where's Yellow's base? I cannot hold this attack off. I don't think I'll be able to kill another one. Yeah, he's way too bulky. He also blew up a tower, so that's kind of oof. But seriously, where the heck are where the heck is Yellow's last town? Why can't I find it? You know what? It probably it, no, it can't be over here. Man, it sucks. No, nothing over there. He didn't claim a town, and I never noticed, did I? Did he? I don't think so. I'm so confused, where could this town possibly be? 
In any case. Okay, green is green is gone though. Okay, now I gotta find yellow, wherever yellow might be. Being out of mana sucks. Oh. Oh, I guess there is a town in there. What? Huh, how about that? There was a town in there. Alright, now we're gonna just finish this map off. Cause I mean, where else could he possibly be, right? Wow, that was the most failed jump I've ever made. But seriously, how do you get in here? Like, the place is blocked off. Alright, let's just finish these guys off. Anyway... This is gonna be the end of the video. I know this one was a bit longer, but I really was hoping to finish this map a lot faster than I did. But I hope you guys enjoyed this Throwback Thursday episode of Heroes of Might Magic 2, The Price of Loyalty. And I will see you guys next time. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and God bless you. Yellow player has been vanquished! The enemy is beaten. Your side has tri has triumphed!